This is the newest synth built into FL Studio. I'm using FL Studio 25 and Kepler XO was released on the 4th of September 2024. On the other hand, this is TS404, the older synth from FL Studio 2 and it's fucking awesome. Okay, so Kepler XO is inspired by the old Roland Juno 6 and Jupiter 8 synths. One of the first things I didn't understand was DCO, and it turns out it stands for Digitally Controlled Oscillator, where we have pulse, saw, and square waveforms, and a couple of LFOs. By the way, LFO stands for Low Frequency Oscillator, which creates waves with a frequency from 0 to 20 hertz, which we can't hear, but it's necessary for modulating pitch, volume, filter, and so on. Further on in Kepler XO, we see cross mode, which is actually just frequency modulation. And here are the rest of the explanations for these three letter values. Overall, Kepler XO has incredibly high quality sound, but of course, we would like to see more wavetables in new synths. Well, let's listen to the presets. Well, that's all for now. Write what you think about Kepler Exo. Bye. All the best.